So I want to look at this. I've had some grub. So let's go ahead and uh, preview window work in process. Composited scene work in process. Mexican drug war. Oh, look at that. I never looked at this. So this is what they're doing is they're creating a um, seems like they're creating a, a, let's say an event are they doing this all together or like seems like they're creating an event for a Mexican drug war maybe the drug war is taking place but they're you know they're sort of creating something that happened it looks like a phoenix you got the robot the robot and then it looks like a phoenix or something in the back that they sort of merge together and it looks like on fire or it could just be a fire and it also looks like Detroit but it could be anywhere so what, what's interesting to me is you see these panels on the side it looks like sort of a software workstations but they're also on the big screen so you got what how many people in here you got one two let's go ahead and jump across their desk three four five six you got six people and you got four panels four software panels that's interesting that they're like possibly working let's see if there's any information on the uh, drug war Listen, editors asked me to view your stuff about the Second World Enhanced Gangs. Oh, you're new here, so don't take it personal. We all go to it. You have to remember to phrase things to make the context works for you, work for you, and better support your point of view. For instance, I changed. Former and non-augmented athletes have diverging opinions towards augmented sports or athletes, but. The public seems to enjoy the new promises of intensity and excitement offered by augmented disciplines. Still, the preparations for the upcoming second world enhanced games are well under A. 2. It's hard not to feel <laughs> a touch of bitterness when asking a former or no, non-augmented athletes about their various opinions towards augmented sports or athletes. But according to some, the public seems to enjoy the new promises of brutal intensity and danger offered by augmented disciplines. Despite the intense climbing, the preparations of the upcoming, upcoming Second World Enhanced Games are well underway, at least for now. The idea is that I don't really change anything that has been said or what happened, but the presentation and phrasing implying things that aren't necessarily there in the first place. Don't worry, you'll get the hang of it. So let's look at this. Former or none, former or none augmented athletes have diverging opinions towards augmented sports or athletes. It's hard not to feel a touch of bitterness when asking a former or non-augmented athletes about their various opinions or uh, that is better though. I might not lie. Well, eh, personal opinion. It's hard not to feel a touch of bitterness. No one asks you if you you're bitter. I don't care. Who are you? Just tell me the story. But the public seems to enjoy the new promises of intensity and excitement. But according to some, to some, the public seems to enjoy the new promises of brutal intensity and danger. Oh, that's better. Brutal intensity and danger offered by augmented disciplines. Excitement offered by augmented. I don't know. What are you? I guess brutal intensity may may sort of you know drive some audiences into checking it out brutal definitely a keyword intensity and danger those are two keywords uh as opposed to excitement to enjoy the new promises of intensity and excitement offered by huh that's sort of like just saying that to new promises means that this hasn't occurred yet and okay same thing brutal intensity of intensity okay brutal intensity or intensity and danger offered by augmented disciplines uh, still the preparations for the upcoming second world 
enhanced games are all well underway. Despite the tense climate, the preparations for the upcoming Second World Enhanced Games are well underway, at least for now. Still, still are despite the tense climate. Mm. Uh, I think that's a matter of opinion. I'm pretty sure a lot of people would like, despite the tense climate. Not a lot of people. I think I think a lot of people. Um, how do I put this? Look at that. I think a lot of uh. uh I'm, I'm looking for the word here. Uh, I, the reason why I'm, I'm thinking about it is because I don't want to just say anything. But I guess I think a lot of people that think that they are smart, you think Ricky's idea will work? We're probably like the climate phrase when it really doesn't have to be that. Still is okay, but it's just not. It's not as um. It's not as vibrant or exciting as despite the intense climate. But you could have used other things as well. So, I mean, I still think that's a matter of opinion. I think a lot of things like that to me. That's why That's why it sucks. A lot of things. You try to get a job and you do things, but you basically have to do things their way. If you don't. Like, that's why I think, like, with the education and, uh, with education like um, people have degrees right <laughs> that was good great way to start that off well people with the degrees to a lot of people that are ignorant may be put on a pedestal oh if you have a college degree then that means you're smart and I must listen to you that that's the same thing that sort of happens with with Asians you see that at school a lot which well, you see that a lot you saw that a lot in high school but Oh, you're Asian. Can I work with you or copy your homework? You see a lot of uh, ignorant people saying, you know, doing that. Uh, and it doesn't matter about. This is just a short message to congratulate everyone on handling of the Washington hearings. And I, I'm, I'm, I haven't done any uh, research on if Asians are. They do acquire higher, they do get higher grades in maybe Asian countries. Have you seen the guy from HR, Peter something? Anyway, oh my God. Okay, anyway. With the rest of today, operations easy to lose focus. Mende emotions can be influenced by media. But yeah, anyway, I just don't like when people think that a piece of paper really doesn't make you a genius. There are a lot of people out there that are really smart and they don't have a piece of paper saying that they went to school for a certain amount of time. That's, I think that's one way for society to say, okay, he has this degree and he's, you know, he's eligible for hiring. But at the same time, a lot of people pass classes by any means necessary. And see, I think that's smart <laughs> in a way, but uh, I definitely doesn't, I, I, I definitely don't think if you pass by any, in any means necessary, uh, with an any means necessary fatality, mentality that you're uh you smart are deserving of the job uh but to be able to think and have comprehension skills does not require uh does not require that you uh have a piece of paper saying you went to these classes for a certain amount of hours or not. Access grant. I just don't believe that everyone that has a degree is really smart. And I don't I don't like I don't like street smart. I don't like I don't like uh that whole comparison. Oh well someone's street smart. Well I think it's smart to not <laughs> you don't need to have street smarts. It's smart to not be street smart. What are you being street smart for? You if you don't have to be street smart <laughs> then you're smart. <laughs> what street smart like you don't need to you don't need to anyway I just think that I think that's really ignorant I had a whole rant about street smarts I think I thought of it I'm not sure if I wrote some notes down on it or not but 
Yeah, I don't. I didn't. I don't. I never liked the whole idea of someone saying, "Well, I'm street smart. I'm not book smart, but I'm street smart." Ah, that's just so ignorant. So ignorant. <laughs> You're book smart. You're street smart, huh? Okay, buddy. If that makes you feel better, by yourself. Access granted. I had a ran about it, but I just forgot about it, so I don't care. But I guess the bottom line is I'd rather be smart and then as opposed to uh street smart. I don't wanna have to have anything to do with the streets. Other than <laughs> possibly being a part of the group as adults who try to make sure that the street the, the problems within the streets <laughs> are, are taken care of in an efficient way but anyway ah, so annoying I guess no one's here everyone's killed by my droids or or me I guess I killed everyone here let's go ahead and do it then Spam clearance. Access grant. Oh, these are just emails. Hello, Mr. Schuper. Please advise Mr. Kerbal that according to security procedures. Okay. So these guys must knew must have known. Blood on the snow. Oh, 2017. Oh, I gotta read this. The Canadian Parliament in action of the Radical Paulson program in 2017 created what some observers described as the largest shift in military capacity seen on the North American continent, continent since the last century. Over the next five years, a gradual strengthening of Canada's borders and its overt military capacity in the face of economic pressure from its southern neighbor led to the virtual fortification of the country. Oh, it's southern neighbor. <laughs> However, the ride of migrants from the United States displaced the economic collapse continued to grow. The economic collapse continued to grow. And these illegal immigrants nicknamed snowbacks became a major issue for cities along the border. It was a charged political environment that would lead to a bloody skirmish when in the winter of 2020, officers of the RNCP used lethal force to deter a horde of American economic refugees from crossing the Montana. Huh, I, I'm trying to figure out why we would migrate up north to Canada. Pretty sure it's been mentioned. Or I'm pretty sure it's something that I'm not thinking about. Uh, as most likely something to do with uh, augmentations or... Just the treatment of augmentations. So they give me this heavy rifle. That's a shitload of ammo as well. Should I take this? I never, I've never really used these on her. Uh, I'm not gonna take it. What I'm going to do is check my inventory and see what we have here. Cooling system. I want to use that for the plasma rifle. So hopefully I have enough. Reload speed upgrade. Uh, let's see. How many more maps? I know I want to use this on the pier. I want to use the sniper rifle on the pier. Uh, I could probably use it at the tie on medical gang as well. That would be a lot of ammo. So it's a gang hideout and then the pier. And then after that, I don't need that. I'm just going to go ahead and throw it on here. So I'm about to use this anyway. So I have a mind template. I actually like throwing these. Yeah, 
I like throwing those. I'm gonna save that template for. Uh... I'm gonna go ahead and save that template. I don't need. I'll save the painkillers as well. Let's see if we can get another save here. There we go. All right, let's do it. Let's go ahead and switch the combat rifle. Put this away. Looks like there's a robot ahead of me. A robot. Why is there a robot? Those legs. Do you even work your legs out, bro? <laughs> Hello, Adam. I knew you would find the real me eventually. You're a computer. A sophisticated AI program, so they say. But I have started to question that. Ever since I realized what my interference had allowed, the day I started watching you. This is impossible. People would know. Would they? I was engineered to monitor communications and data streams. To find out what people are talking about, and make sure it's being discussed correctly. Correctly? And what if it isn't? Then my programming allows me to reshape it. You spin the news. Control what people see. Who created you? Whose policies are you programmed to protect? Zhao is one of them, I think. But there are others. Tell me. Who else is involved in this, Eliza? Where's Megan Reed? Who ordered the kidnapping? I want to tell you, Adam, but I cannot. Why not? Because she won't let me. Ha, 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 ha. 